Hey everybody, I know it's been a while since I did an IGTV video because, yes, yours truly has been very busy with a lot of things. I just graduated college last month, and I've been traveling, just went to London, and I just came back from Colorado. So, I, today's video, I want to talk to you guys about how to survive a trip to Colorado because Colorado is much different than it is New York. It's all the way in the mountains. Yup, it's all the way above sea level in the elevation. So it's very different than most states you go to because you're behind the Rocky Mountains. So, yeah. So that's what I want to talk to you guys about today. How to survive a college trip to Colorado because it can get to the elevation. I'm not kidding you. Trust me, it's crazy. So, yeah, because when you go to the plane, it feels like this. When you go to the plane, this when you go to the plane, you're like pushing a wall. It's like you're pushing something. It's like... It automatically gets to you when you get off the jet bridge. It's like crazy. It's nuts, Colorado, the elevation. It can really get to you. So if you're going to Colorado, here's a few tips if you want to have a good time in Colorado. So first off, for starters, drink lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of water. I mean drink it because you will get dehydrated there easily at the, at the altitude and elevation because it will get to you in a split second. So... It's crazy how high that elevation can dehydrate you. That's why don't drink anything of caffeine. Do not drink any soda. If you're going to drink soda, don't drink anything of caffeine. Avoid Coke Zero. Avoid Mountain Dew. I'm sorry. I have to say that. Avoid Mountain Dew. I know that's my biggest drink product. I love the drink. love Mountain Dew, but I couldn't can't even drink that because it will dehydrate you caffeine. But if you want to drink soda, drink like Sierra Mist or something that's caffeine free. So, yeah. And also, if you're going to Colorado, if you're going to run there, take it easy. Don't overdo yourself because if you run too fast, you get dehydrated the elevation. It's not like running in Long Beach where you have sea level. It, you will, it will dehydrate you. I'm not kidding. This elevation will make you tired. It gets it takes a while to get used to. So if you're going to do a lot of, if you get to the first day, don't do too much heavy cardio because you can get out of breath. You can get dehydrated from the elevation. So... Try to swim and also just make sure you stay hydrated the whole time there because the elevation is crazy. It will get to you. So that's pretty much all I have from this video today. I know it's been a long time. I'm definitely going to get back on track on doing IGTV videos at least maybe once a week or so, what have you. So I know it's just been so busy last month. I've just been so swamped with a lot of things last month. i just sorry if I... Did took a month off of doing IGT videos, but just I've been crazy. It's been crazy with events. So that's all I have for today. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and hopefully you guys get an opportunity to go out to Colorado. It's a beautiful state. I'll do more there next time. I go up to the mountains for real. I'll go to the Rocky Mountains. Go to skiing, and maybe if I'm lucky, I'll shoot my first TV commercial for Mountain Dew up there. Knock on wood. All right. Thank you all very much. Have a good day and happy first day of summer.